hello guys welcome back to my channel in this video i'll be showing you how i'm gonna make this uh, so should i call it sandwich yeah you can use it as breakfast or lunch depends on how you want it okay so i'll be using two eggs i'll be using milk so you can use any kind of milk of your choice i'll be using cheese so this cheese is two type like so it depends on the one you want so the other cheese is like this and the other one is like this so then i will be using slice uh, meat i think this one is uh, chicken or something then i'll be using slice uh, bread i'll be using white bread and brown bread so it depends on how you want it also you can use any so kind of bread of your choice of okay so you can use any uh, sauce of your choice you can use mayonnaise depends on how you want it how you want the taste to look like so i'm adding my cheese now so guys don't mind my nails okay because i'm trying to take them out so that's why my nails is like that if you are new welcome to my channel please if you have not subscribed don't forget to subscribe subscribe turn on the notification bell like my videos share and comment and tell me what you think about my videos and to my old subscribers, I want to say thank you guys. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks for your support. I really appreciate it, guys. Thanks so much. May God continue to bless you all for me. So I put my bread into the mist egg, so I will just let it soak, like, you know, turn it around to soak a little bit. So <laughs> that's it. So if you're on diet, I don't think this is for you. <laughs>
Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how I made this wig. So if you are new to my channel, you are welcome. I want to say thank you. Thanks so much. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not done that. Subscribe to my channel to get more videos like this, please. And to my old subscribers, I want to say thank you all. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks for your support. I really appreciate. I really appreciate. So in this week, I will be using uh already used hair so it's for a friend so i just want to help her to put it on the wig so the hair has been used before and then as you can see i'm sewing nets on the dumb cap because there's the closure that she had before is torn like the closure is not good anymore so i just have to make a new closure for her you know <laughs> just to try something new so, I will leave you guys to continue watching. cut off the hair on the closure before because the closure is not good anymore so this is the hair i got from it so i will just make another closure from it now
that are on it so what do you think the headphones are very beautiful so i just said i should try it <laughs> so i love the way it turns out though it's beautiful i think she will be very happy to see the hair like this so guys thanks for watching thanks so much please don't forget to subscribe comment like and share my videos thank you so much bye love you guys take care Against the world, I never tried to for anybody else to brown skin girl. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, my name is Blessing. And uh, you are welcome to my other subscribers. I want to say thank you. If you are new, you are welcome. Please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification bell, like my videos and share. So in this video is is a very quick one, okay? So I have uh, three egg in here, so I put my salt inside the egg. So I'm just gonna mix the egg together. So you just have to continue mixing. So I'm done mixing it. Then I have my olive oil already in the pan. So I'll be using olive oil. Okay. So I just turn my egg inside the pan. Then I'll put my bread. So I will leave this process for about two minutes. Two minutes before I will turn it. So I will turn my head down. So in here, I will be adding my cheese. I think in fresh it's called the shade the one they put in burgers. So that is what I'll be doing. Then I will add my sauce. Sauce is called Samora. So I'll be adding it too. So it's very spicy, this sauce. And it's really, it tastes well. So guys, we are done with our breakfast. So you see, it's very easy and very quick. So you are welcome to my channel if you are new. And to my other subscribers, I want to say thank you. Thank you guys. So if you are new, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Wow, look at how this is looking. <laughs> so guys, what do you think about it? It looks so yummy. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye. Love you.
hello guys welcome back to my channel so if you are new you are welcome so as you can notice i'm not wearing any makeup i'm not wearing any makeup so that is because i'll be sharing with you guys what i use on my face one of the home remedy that i use on my face face so i'll be using a tomatoes face mask with just just one ingredient huh? so it can lighten up it can lighten up your dark spots your this area of your eyes can brighten it up because tomatoes brighten up skin makes you look younger okay so <laughs> we will just go direct to the video so before we go to the video please 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 don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not done that like comment and click the notification bell below so that you can get notified whenever i post a new videos okay so guys let's go right into the video so this is the tomato that i will be using so i'm going to cut it into two parts okay so in case if you don't know tomatoes can brighten skin and it can give a youthful um, appearance it can glue skin also and then it can also reduce excess production of oil from your face okay so it removes dark spots dirty and dead skin and it helps to fight um, acne as well okay so there's a lot of benefits from tomatoes So guys, I just finished cleaning my face. So I just clean my face first. So before I will use the tomatoes on my face. So I will use it as mask. You just have to get your tomato. Then use it to rub your face in circular motion. The tomato is very cold. <laughs> so you just have to rub it in circular motion. And just continue the process. Rub it like at least two minutes before you can stop so you just have to continue rubbing so uh, if you know you have a sensitive skin so i wouldn't advise you to use this um mask like every day so it's not advisable but if you know you have oil face like oil face then it's advisable to use it even if you want to use it like every evening so because it reduces all year from the face okay so you can use it it really helps a lot so you just have to continue rubbing or should i say scrubbing or rubbing <laughs> okay so that's it guys then you just have to continue and then you can later wash it out of your face So guys i'm almost done so i'm just i just continue the process rubbing it so i will just go and wash it out see you guys later just let me wash it and come back okay so guys i just finished washing my face it looks so soft <laughs> so as you can see in this other side i still have this dark spot here so I still have the dark spot on the other side. So in this area, that is where I have the dark spot. So the other side is almost finished. So I'm still continuing using things that will clear this face. Like seriously, guys. <laughs> but I'm happy though because it's more better now. Like than before is more better. Seriously. So please, please. So guys, in whatever thing that you are using, so you just have to be consistent, okay? So don't just use it once 
then you think you will get a result. No, you at least you have to use it days, like two days, three days, a week or two weeks, because everybody's skin are not the same. So what work for me might not work for you, but you just have to continue trying. So that is what I'm doing. So I can I just have to try, continue to try. So you if you have any moisturizing cream. Then you just have to use it on your face to massage your face, you know, rub your face. So me, I will be use, I'm using coconut. So if if you have coconut oil, like virgin coconut oil, you can still use it also on your face. So you just have to rub it like as if you are massaging your face, you know. So you just have to continue you rub it very well. So that is it. So you just have to don't give up. Don't give up on your skin. So you just have to try. So if you see my skin before, like maybe I have already showed a picture of my previous uh, video. So if you see my skin before, then you will know that I've really gone far, like, you know, with what I'm using. So you just have to continue using. Don't give up, okay? Use whatever that you are using. If it works for you, continue using it. Be consistent don't stop don't give up okay we move huh? <laughs> so guys thanks for watching i really appreciate it. thanks so much so if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe okay subscribe to my channel so that i can share with you a lot of videos like this okay so see you guys so what do you think about the face it's glowing no <laughs> so I forgot to say it before. This tomatoes mask is not just for girls. Men can use it also. Okay. <laughs> so the men can try it as well. It works super well. See you guys. Bye bye. So guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will be showing you how I made this beautiful wig. So if you are new to my channel, thanks for coming, you are welcome. And to my old subscribers, I want to say thank you so, so much. Thanks for your support. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever I post the new videos because I will be coming up with a lot of videos for you guys to see, to watch. So in this part, I'm trying to sew the airband to the dummy cap. So just continue washing. I'm going to sew it run. so because you can just after finishing the wig you can just flip the band up so you can flip it also like this then you can cut off the SS cap if you want depends on how you want it
this is the air i will be using you can get it from any of your beauty supply store you can get it from any air store so i will just be doing the regular crochet so i'm just going to trim trim it off like the ss hair i will trim the ss hair the long ones out
wow guys do you see how beautiful this hair look wow i'm so loving it it's really beautiful so what i will do i will take the wig off then i will try to cut off the ss cap so if you like you can leave the ss cap so it depends on how you want it because of the the band on it but sometimes wig band normally gets smaller when you finish the wig so it depends on how you want it is either you leave it or you can cut it off okay so guys thanks for watching i really appreciate thank you very much if you have not subscribed please subscribe to my channel like comment turn on the notification hello guys welcome back to my channel if you are new thanks for coming thanks for being here thanks for your support and please don't forget to subscribe turn on the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever i post any new videos and if you are a whole subscribers i want to say thank you so much thanks for your support thanks for being here so let's go right to the video so in this video i'll be showing you the home remedy one of the home remedy that i use on my face if you can see this is one pimples here so i'll be showing you it's just vaseline and toothpaste this is my face before you can see there's a lot of difference so I'll be using this toothpaste, then the Vaseline. So these two things can do wonders. It's just simple, easy. Just two things. It can dry up your pimples. You can even remove dark spots. So you can do a lot of things. So just try it. So I normally apply this at night. So whenever you do it, you can leave it at least five minutes or so okay like five minutes or so so you can then rest it out okay so let's miss it so here is my vaseline so i will take um a little amount then put it on my bowl so if you have uh, oil skin you can skip this part you can add the uh, coconut oil if you want but if you have dry skin this one is very good for your skin the with i mean the vaseline so i'm adding my colgate to it so after adding the colgate i will just mix it together so just mix then continue the process continue missing just mix it very well it's very important this remedy is very simple but amazing remedy that will work wonders for your skin this remedy will not only remove all dark spots and scars from your face it will also get rid of blackheads and pimples so i have mixed it and this is how it look, looks so you can before you start before you apply it all over your face you just have to maybe take a little to test your face or you can even test your hand back of your hand so if it doesn't react to your face like then you can continue to apply it okay so you can apply with ends your end then you can apply with your brush any kind of brush okay so you can use whatever thing that feels good for you
so i'm done applying it on my face you will have to wait five minutes before you can rinse it out then you rinse everything so you can leave it for maybe three five minutes depends on how you want it you can leave it how long you want then you can use warm water to wash your face and make sure you wash it very well so that everything can go out of your face so i'm washing mine now Imagine how my face was looking before and imagine now. So look at it now. So I think there is a little bit difference or should I say a huge difference from the uh, previous uh, picture I just showed you. So this is how it look. This is what I'm be using for some time. So I decided to share it with you guys. So guys, I will be sharing a lot of videos with you about the remedies i'm using on my face the home remedies so subscribe to my channel if you are new turn on the notification bell and please don't forget to like comment and share my videos so guys if there is any video that you want me to show you or to share with you just leave your comments on the comment section then i will show you guys so this is how the face is looking so what do you think thanks for watching i really appreciate and then i will see you guys on my next one see you hello guys welcome back to my channel it's me your girl mom blessing to my old subscribers, I want to say thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate. I really appreciate. And if you are new, what are you waiting for? Have you subscribed? Please subscribe to my channel. Like, share, and comment. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell to always get my new videos. And please don't forget to share with your friends, your family, your loved ones. Just share my videos and subscribe. I really love you guys. Thank you very much, and I appreciate. I really appreciate your support thanks so so much so in this video i will be showing you how i made this beautiful wig please stay tuned and watch to the end thank you love you guys so guys i just finished drawing the attachment so your attachment when, when you finish cutting it you have to draw it so i just finished drawing the attachment so i'm going to start with the closure so I'm going to put closure. I will start with the closure. So just watch guys. So what I'm doing, I'm just putting the hook, the crochet needle, because I'm using the tiny crochet needle. So I just put it through the, the wick cap. Then I take a little amount of hair. Then I put it through the needle. Then I draw it out. Let me leave you to wash it guys. Just wash and see what I'm doing.
guys i'm done with the front side of the hair with the closure that i just made so i will start from the back so i will start the big uh, crochet from the back so guys i have started from the back as you can see so i just take the hook the crochet needle then i put it through my wick up then i'm going to get some hair then i take some hair so you have to try not not to let the hair to tangle you have to detangle the hair then you can put it through the needle you put it on the needle you, you have to close your hook then you close and then you take the hair put it through the hair and drag it out okay so it depends on how you want it you can tie it twice or you can tie it just once so i will still show you guys if you want to do it like if you want to tie it twice okay so you just continue to wash guys i'm almost done so i changed my crochet needle because i want the front to be more smaller so that's why i decided to change my crochet needle then i use the small uh, crochet needle like the medium thing i don't really know i think it's the medium one so i use this one to finish it up guys i'm done with the crochet method so you see how beautiful it is already you can even rock it like this straight like this if you want but i'll be coiling mine so you can still rock it like this in this method i'll be using wool to tie it so that i can put it in hot water so that we can get the coils that we want so I'm using the wool to pass through the hair so please don't tight it too much because if you tight it too much you'll not be able to drag to draw it okay just watch and then you will see what I'm saying you understand you have to tie it very well so that it doesn't lose when you are putting it into the uh, hot water okay so i will take it now and i will, then i will put it into uh, hot water in my hot water i added conditioner get your water to be too hot okay so i took it out of hot water so i'm trying to lose the wool so before I started losing the wool, I just rubbed my pan with oil. So the reason why I did that so that the hair won't tangle when I'm trying to lose the coils, okay?
wow guys this is beautiful what do you think about this hair please leave your comments below and tell me what you think about this hair and please don't forget to like comment and share if you are new here if you have not subscribed yet what are you waiting for you have to subscribe subscribe to my channel please don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever i post a new video please so guys i'm not trying this hair on my head it's because the hair is not for me it's for a friend so that's why i'm not trying it on on my head i love you guys thank you so so much thank you so much thank you bye see you on my next one hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is blessing in this video i will be showing you how to make a short natural afro wig please continue watching if you are new please subscribe if you are old subscriber thanks for being here i really appreciate and please don't forget to comment share like my video and please don't forget to turn on the notification bell below so that you can get notified whenever i post a new video thank you guys this is how far i have gone so as you can see i'm doing it a little bit closer because i don't want the wig to have a lot of space <laughs>
guys i'm so loving this wig can't you see it looks so so natural let me wait for you guys to see wow this is so beautiful i love the wig so much it looks so natural what do you guys think please leave your comments below and tell me what you think about this wig and thanks for watching please don't forget to subscribe and see you on my next one hello guys welcome to my youtube channel if you want to know how i made this look please stay tuned and please don't forget to subscribe share and like my video please guys this is my first video on youtube so if there's something i'm not doing well please just leave your comments and i will appreciate that thank you very much Enjoy.